Hello, I'm Keith Ford here at Brownells, and today I'm going to talk about a very sensitive subject, the Colt Python versus the Smith & Wesson Model 27. Let's discuss. Now, the Smith & Wesson Model 27, you can trace it back to the mid-30s whenever they introduced the Register Magnum, and eventually becoming the Model 27. This was Smith & Wesson's top-of-the-line premium 357 Magnum. It was their workhorse and a very reliable gun. Now in the 1950s, around 1955, Colt developed Colt Python. This was their premium gun and was a competitor head-to-head -head with the Smith & Wesson. Now the finish on the Colt is immaculate. These guns were hand-polished, hand-fitted, hand-tuned. They were the thoroughbred of the bunch. Now with the Colt, you have an elegant, styling, classic design. The Trigger is buttery smooth, but the thing is with the double action on these, they have a stacking as you get towards the end of the pull. Smith & Wesson is constant and steady. But with the Colt, the single action is where it's at. This is just insanely smooth on the single action pull, where the Smith & Wesson, it's just to me not the same. Now the Smith, you have Parts in here that can be fitted by just about anybody with any gunsmithing experience. You can change out hands, you can change out cylinder stops, whatever, and it doesn't affect anything that's going on in here. You can get these in time and run just fine. Whereas the Colt Python, it pretty much requires someone with special skills to get the internals going because you can't just change one part out and expect it to not affect everything else. It's kind of like a domino effect. Now the Colt, honestly, it really wasn't designed to handle hot and heavy 357 Magnum loads, and they had a problem with going out of time, running them hard. Now if you were bullseye shooting, 38s, occasional 357 loads, man, they're fine. Now on the 357 Smith & Wesson here, the Model 27, you can run this thing all day long, this is hard and it's not going to break down on you. Now this Smith & Wesson Model 27 is a five inch with a target hammer, target trigger, and was considered one of the finest handguns ever made by the late firearms writer, Skeeter Skelt. Colt Python, it has kind of achieved cult status due to it being featured in The Walking Dead, and prices on these have just gone insane. And prices on the Smith & Wesson 27, they're not cheap as well. Which one's the best? It really depends on what you're doing and what you're shooting. So let us know what you think. Which one is the best to you, the Model 27 or the Colt Python? Thanks for watching. Be sure and tune in again.